This is the third diversity symposium I've been able to participate in since becoming president of Colorado State University. It's an annual event I particularly value because it underscores CSU's commitment to be a place where every single person who chooses to come here, faculty, students, and staff, will feel welcome and valued and have the tools and support they need to succeed. I'm always impressed by the excellence of the invited speakers and presenters, the relevance, breadth, and depth of their topics, and by the quality of the scholarship and contributions made by so many of our CSU faculty and staff who also serve as presenters and moderators. I especially want to express my gratitude to the Diversity Symposium Planning Committee and the team in the Office of Inclusive Excellence for all of their efforts, not just in putting together this outstanding symposium, but really for their commitment to the work they do year round that makes our community a better place. Inclusive excellence, a term that so eloquently embraces our goals of diversity, equity, inclusion, and justice, has been at the top of my list since I arrived at Colorado State University. It is one of the most important parts of and a foundation on which we're designing and building our courageous strategic transformation for CSU. So I can't tell you how pleased I am to have our new Vice President, Dr. Colleen Cipriani, as a partner in doing that. Her outstanding experience, coupled with the fresh perspectives that she brings to CSU and her clear passion and commitment for the work, give me tremendous confidence about our future. Finally, I want to thank all of you who are virtually attending these sessions in such large numbers for the second consecutive year and for engaging on the critical topics of diversity, equity, inclusion, and justice. As you listen and engage this week, I want to encourage you to think deeply about what you hear and learn, about how you can apply these things to areas of your own lives, in your jobs, your communities, and in the interactions you have with others you encounter every day. Thank all of you again for your participation and contributions that make this such a great event.